Jeff, I'm a junior designer. Um, I study at Liverpool Community College doing an MVQ level four in creative and digital media, which is a new course that's come about over the last, say, 12 to 18 months because there are more and more apprenticeships coming into this sector and it's important that they are getting the valuable education skills to go alongside the job skills. My college course is on a Monday morning. I just go from nine till 12 and um, it's like a portfolio I have to put together. We have set units and it's marked by the college and then an assessor. Um, it's a mixture of work-based and class-based and it's all put together over 12 months. On a day-to-day -day basis, I'll um, interact with clients, I design websites, business cards, do marketing with them. Um, we set up social media campaigns, which is all new to, I suppose, in the 21st century. There's a lot of older businesses now trying to come into it and they don't really know what Twitter, Facebook and LinkedIn is. They just know they need it and they just want to know how. I enjoy interacting with people on the phone and because I'll be on the phone to clients asking them, you know, what are the design requirements and, and we'll meet up and we'll have like meetings. So I'll like run my own meeting and I'll um, sit and talk, discuss with clients, build up a relationship. Normal days half eight till five, but if there are deadlines, you know, you're not expected to, but you sort of, you want to, you know, finish to get to that deadline, you have set times, and if it's got to be in for five o'clock that day, then you'll wait till, till when you need to get it done, sort of thing. It's a, I suppose it's a demanding industry, but it's fun. <laughs> the technical side of things, I suppose I, I knew a small amount of it, and I knew probably a bit more than some people would, but I suppose it's other skills that you need. It's like communicating with people, people skills, and just self-belief, I think, more than anything. Yeah, within this industry, I suppose it, it is male-dominated, and when I do ring suppliers sometimes, or if I ring the technical guys, they'll, they'll be sort of taken back that I know what I'm asking. I don't think they think women I suppose in this sector have a place at the moment, I don't know, I think it's a bit of a, a torn between whether women are just as good as men within the creative and digital industry because it's so male dominated. A lot of our female clients, you know, they, they want websites and they want marketing, but they don't like the technical side of it, like they don't really need to know the functionality behind of it, they just want a nice website and things that can help promote the business and they, they, they tend to feel like it's easier to talk to a woman about it. Within this industry, there's so many roles that I can go into at the moment. I'm in like a graphic design, web design role, but I can go more web design, more graphic design. I can go to magazines and just produce the artwork for magazines. There's so many possibilities. I can even study further and go into more like flash-based um, technical side of things or stay more just design focused. There's, there's so many sort of pathways to go to that this apprenticeship offers that it's not you're sort of stuck in one place. There's so many different routes you can go to.